Something magic happens Every time you go You make the magic happen The magic of Orioles baseball Hey guys, how's everybody doing today? Autographs 2000 here And in today's video I'm going to show you five Autographs through the mail, TTMs and we're going to open up two more packs of uh, 2023 tops. As always, we will start with TTMs. The first one is from Macon, Georgia. We have got Jeff Treadway. He signed two of two in 25 days. He had a career batting average of 281 with 28 home runs, 208 RBIs. He played nine years. He appeared in 762 games. He played from 87 to 95. And he played with Cincinnati, Atlanta, Cleveland, Los Angeles, and Montreal. Um, his best year was in 1990 when he had 11 home runs, knocked in 59. And he batted two, 283 that year. And also, during that year, he had his best game of his career. It was in Philadelphia at Veterans Stadium. They were retiring uh, Mike Schmidt's number that, day, that night. And Jeff Treadway hit three home runs. All three different pitchers. So that was, that was his big night. That was his night to remember. All right, our second return is from Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. And we've got Ed Ott. He signed three of three in 15 days. He had a career batting average of 259, with 33 home runs, 195 RBIs. He played eight years. He appeared in 567 games. He played from 71 to 84. And he played with Pittsburgh, California, Pittsburgh and California. His best season, um, he hit seven home runs, knocked in 51, and he batted 273. He has a pretty small autograph. I'm wondering if he's if he signed that one so small. Think that I'm thinking I was gonna send it to other people. I bet you that's why he did signed it. That one so small. But. And again, that is Ed Ott. All right, our third return comes to us from San Bernardino, California. We've got Steve Hargan. He signed 404 in 30 days. He had a career record of 87 and 107. With a 3.92 ERA, he played 12 years, appeared in 354 games. He played from 65 to 77, and he played with Cleveland, Texas, Toronto, and Atlanta. His best year was in 1967 uh, when he was an All-Star, and in that year he went 14 and 13 with a 2.62 ERA. And I'm going to tell you, these do not look very good where he signed them. They're smudged. He needs to use, he needs a better Sharpie or an ink pen or something. But these, these don't look very good at all. That's probably the best one. And it is not great at all. Steve Hargan. All right, before we get to our next returns, let's go ahead and open, let's go ahead and open a pack. This is our third pack. We opened two on the last video. We're gonna open two on this video. And we didn't get anything really good on the last pack, last couple packs. So let's hope our luck turns around here. We have Andrew Benatendi, Christian Javier, Tommy Pham, German Marquez, JT Realmuto, 
I see one flipped upside down. Uh oh. We have Zach Thompson, Chris Bryant, Tanner Rainey. Uh oh, we got a Mike Trout turned upside down. Look at that. Look at that. That is that is nice. That is nice. Nice rainbow of Mike Trout. That is a sweet uniform he's wearing. Put him up here. Very sweet looking Mike Trout. Next up we got a Riley Green, Stars of MLB. We have Jimmy, Jimmy Herget. We got the Mets. We got the Royals. And then we've got Judge, Ramirez, and Tucker. All right, so that was a pretty good pack. I think that trout looks pretty sweet. All right, our next return is from Raleigh, North Carolina. And we have got Mike Caldwell. He signed 3 of 3 in 29 days. He had a career record of 137 and 130 with a 3.81 ERA. He played 14 years. He appeared in 475 games. He played from 71 to 84. And he played with San Diego, San Francisco, Cincinnati, and Milwaukee. His best year was in 1978 when he went 22-9 and with a 2.36 ERA. And he finished second in the Cy Young voting. And he finished second to Ron Guidry. As he inscribed that card, 22 and 9 in 78. And then this one, he was 2 and 0. He inscribed he was 2 and 0 in the 82 World Series. So, per, two pretty sweet inscriptions from Mr. Mike Caldwell. All right, before we get to our last return, we're going to go ahead and open up our second pack here. And let's see what we got. We have got a Patrick Sandoval. We got Shane, don't call me Justin Bieber. Kevin Galsman. Sandy Alcantara. We got a Bobby Witt All-Star Rookie Cup. We got Aaron Ashby, Brad Keller, Roberto Perez. We have got a 2022 Greatest Hits, Juan Soto. That's a pretty sweet card. And we're going to follow it up with another Stars of MLB, Juan Soto. And then we've got Welcome, welcome Shower for Buxton. We got the Mets power power or Pat, Bats power of victory. We got Michael Harris rookie card and and cup. That's pretty sweet. He's got them both. We got Josh Stallmont, and that is it. That is it. All right, our final return is from Miami, Florida, and it is a UFC return. It is from Joanna Drzejczyk. She signed two of one, and she sent her. Um, she sent an extra card. This one. She signed two of one in forty-seven days. She is regarded as the greatest strawweight of all time, as she has said. Um, she is the one that put that division on the map. Um, her kickboxing record was twenty-seven and three. Her MMA record is 16 and 5. Um, she has been a professional fighter, or she was, from 2012 to 2022. Uh, while in the U.S. or as a MMA fighter, she started her career off 14 and 0. Um, but in her last seven fights, she was only 2 and 5. So, but she was she was awesome there for. 
She was awesome there for a good bit. And that is Joanna Drozacic. And yeah, so that one didn't come out the greatest, but the one that she included, that tops chrome, that looks pretty sweet. And she even put it in a penny sleeve. All right, guys, so that's going to do it for this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that like button. If you've not subscribed yet, please do so. Tell your friends to subscribe. Tell your friends' friends to subscribe. And until next time, guys, Autographs 2000 is out.